Hi, my name is Katherine Parrish, Artichoke Festival Board President. This year we celebrated the 61st Artichoke Festival with great success. Without the help and financial support of all of our sponsors, the festival wouldn't be possible. Over the last 61 years, the festival has evolved and become a 501c3 nonprofit. Our mission is to raise money and to give back to the surrounding communities of Castorville, California in a wonderful celebration of the artichoke. Without all of you, this wouldn't be an easy task. So a big thank you again to all of our sponsors, volunteers, and to the supporting community. The success of this year's festival allowed us to donate $43,000 Dating back to the early 2000s, the Artichoke Festival has given over a half a million dollars back to the community and nonprofit organizations in the area. I want to thank all of our board members. They are all volunteers and a working board. Without their dedication, hard work, and support, we would not be able to pull the festival together. I thank you from the bottom of my heart. You have all gone above and beyond what is necessary and expected and share the vision to put on a wonderful community event. I know we have all had a difficult year with COVID, but with your help, we have had a successful year. Our committee heads are also an integral part of our organization. They all work tirelessly throughout the entire year. Enduring endless meetings, questions for myself, our executive director and the board. You are all saints and we appreciate everything you do for us. Lastly, I would like to thank our executive director, Linda Shear. Linda has worked tirelessly for the festival and is an integral part of our success. Not only is she involved with every aspect, but her entire family are all volunteers. Thank you, Linda. Hello, my name is Alex Garcia, an Artichoke Festival board member. I want to thank the volunteers and beneficiaries of this year's festival. The Artichoke Festival can only be a success each year because of the strong support provided by a very selfless volunteer community. These organizations give their time, hard work, and dedication to help make our event enjoyable for everyone, and more importantly, to make it possible for the festival committee to fulfill its mission to give back to the surrounding communities of Castorville in a wonderful celebration of the Artichoke. For this 61st year of the festival, we are once again proud and honored to give back to our local nonprofit community of beneficiaries. We hope this will help provide the ongoing support and resources you need to help your nonprofit fulfill its own mission in the coming years. We are proud to honor our 2021 beneficiaries. Hope Horses and Kids, Crucio and Christianity, Golden State Elite Cheer and Dance Team, Partnership for Children, North Monterey County High School Wrestling, the North Monterey County High School Cheer Team, the North Monterey County Middle School Library, Rancho San Juan Baseball, Marine Alliance Club, the North Monterey County Recreation and Park District, Federacion San Carlos de Colores, Santa Lucia Rotary Club of Salinas, Ashley Nicole Swain Memorial Scholarship Fund, presenting to North Monterey County High School Art Department. Hartnell College, Castorville Education Center. Hello everyone, my name is Stephanie Cordoposi and I am the festival chairperson for the food booths and also a board of directors for the Artichoke Festival. I'm here to present our volunteer uh, group donations that we've done. The first group that I have here tonight is Emily Burton and Lori Tuttle. They are with the organization Hope Horses and Kids. Hope Horses and Kids is an equine assisted learning program. They work with kids of all abilities, but primarily with kids who have special needs. During the past 18 months of the pandemic, they've been seeing a lot of kids who are anxious, depressed, and scared. Hope Horses and Kids gives them the opportunity to get outside, be with their peers, and learn new skills. The horses give them support and confidence when they most need it. They customize their programs to the needs of their client. For this year's festival, because of all your hard work, we would like to present this check to you in the amount of $3,000. <laughs> 
for all of your hard work that you do for us. Oh my God. Oh my gosh. And so that you may be able to continue your wonderful program for all of the kids in the community. So You're welcome. You. Thank you for everything you do. Wanted to thank you for having us back. It felt very um, normal to be back with the festival and it was fun to be doing something again normal um the past 18 months we have um gone through a pandemic and in the middle of the pandemic we went through the horrible fires in august we evacuated 44 horses two goats and two barn cats to two separate evacuation sites all the while you know running our program and um had to shut down the program for a while got back running and then floods came in january We've since moved our program down to a new ranch. So it's been, it's been an 18 months and we just wanna thank you for this because this kind of support is what we need to keep on working with the kids. So Emily and I, you know, from the bottom of our hearts, just wanna thank you all very, very much. Thank and I thank you. you both very, thank very you. much. Thank you. I look forward to seeing you guys every year. Oh, we will be we back. It. It's, our, it's oh. our favorite. Thank you so much. <laughs> You're thank welcome. you. You're welcome. Our next group tonight is Curcio and Christianity. We have with us Cindy Stefani and Amber Souza. Curcio and Christianity is a ministry of the Diocese of Monterey. They hold Catholic spiritual retreats for men and women 18 years of age and older. During the three-day retreat, participants learn the fundamentals of living a Christian life. They experience the joy of being a part of a Christian community and are encouraged to bring back to their community what they have learned. Their motto is, make a friend, be a friend, bring your friend to Christ. Hi there. Hi. On behalf of the Artichoke Festival, we would like to present you with your donation of $3,000 oh for your group, Thank for all of the hard you. work. That's Thank you. you, oh you are gosh. welcome. This group here works so tirelessly much. the complete two days, cooking, cleaning. Their booth is spotless when uh, they leave for the weekend, which I greatly appreciate. And they do a lot of hard work and you deserve every penny of it. Thank you Thank so you. much. You're welcome. On behalf of the Crisillo community, we'd like to thank the Archo Festival Committee for this beautiful, wonderful donation. This will be used for scholarships for people that can't afford to uh, attend the retreats, the financial re needs, and also for our facilities that, that it costs more money now and the insurance. So thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Our next group is the North Monterey County Unified School District Middle School Library. Um, they have been working for the festival for over 20 years. The donations that they receive from the festival go towards uh, purchasing new books as well as technology for the library. Unfortunately, their representative couldn't be here tonight, but we have uh, a check to present to them in the amount of $3,500. This check is presented to North Monterey County Unified School District Middle School Library on behalf of the festival in the amount of $3,500. This check um, represents the appreciation that I have for the group the, uh, and their continued support and work for the festival. Thank you very much to all of you and we will see you next year. Our next group is the Federacion San Carlos de Colores. They are a Curcio group from Watsonville. This year it was the uh, group's first year of volunteering their time in our fried artichoke booth and they did a wonderful job and unfortunately their representative also could not be here tonight but we would like to present them with a check for $1,500. I would like to present this check to the Federacion San Carlos de Calores in the amount of $1,500 for the hard work that they um, performed during the festival and we hope to see you again next year. Thank you. My next group is Golden State Elite Cheer and Dance. It is an organization that provides competitive and recreational palm and hip hop dance for children four years of age and over. They go to a lot of competitions and they work tirelessly for us every year. So this year I would like to present to them a check in the amount of $3,000. 
This check is presented to Golden State Elite to chair and dance in the amount of $3,000 for their organization. They work tirelessly every year for the festival and I re really appreciate everything they do. Um, thank you and we'll see you next year. Hi, it's my pleasure to introduce you to Ruben. He is the president of the Santa Lucia Rotary here in Salinas. Hi, how are you doing? Fine, it's a pleasure to have you here. Thank you. And I just wanted to tell you, thank you so very much for you and your group of wonderful people that came out and donated your time and energy to the Artichoke Festival. Great, it was our pleasure coming out and helping the community and giving back. We had a great time and we look forward to doing it again in the near future. And uh, thank you. Oh, you're very welcome. This is going to be the beginning of a great partnership. Yes, yes, I believe so. so. I would like to present you with a $2,500 check from the Artichoke oh, wow. Festival. It was a great privilege to have the opportunity to work with, with all you and all your, your members and uh, make a great friendship and, you know, let's prosper and, and help our community. Absolutely. Thank, Thank you, you very, very much. much for the invite. Thank you very you're much. Welcome. As uh, Santa Lucia's president, um, it's a great honor and thank you for we'll receive this check and we'll put this to great use. Thank you. Partnership for Children provides transportation and family support services for children with life-threatening conditions living in Monterey, Santa Cruz, and San Benito counties. Partnership for Children transportation and financial assistance programs increase access to compassionate care for children on the Central Coast. The Artichoke Festival Chef Demo Room is a tough area to manage. In preparation, hundreds of phone calls are made to some of the top chefs throughout the Monterey County. In addition, keeping the chefs well stocked, keeping their area, the table, the chef table clean, uh, and, and just keeping a good flow going is definitely no easy task. This year, the festival was extremely honored to have Jennifer Ramirez, the Executive Director for Partnership for Children, step up and take on this, this enormous task. Jennifer and her team did an amazing job this year, and we're honored to have Partnership for Children and, her, and the team on board. And we're definitely looking forward to many years uh, to come. The Artichoke Festival is really excited and happy to present a check for $5,000 to Partnership for Children. Uh, we for sorry. your <laughs> for okay. all your hard work and thank you, you know, for uh, just taking on this tremendous task of, uh, of the chef demo room. You know, thank without you. your guys' help and support, we definitely, you know, couldn't make it. We couldn't do it without you. Our team at Partnership for Children had so much fun this year joining the Artichoke Festival and uh, coordinating the chef demos. We were amazed at the sense of community that came together around the festival and working with all of the different groups and the partners from the Artichoke Festival Committee and Board to the chef that chefs that came in to do demos to our team at Partnership for Children, all the staff and volunteers. Um, it really was just an energized uh, atmosphere that we were so incredibly grateful to be a part of and we are looking forward to doing this again and making it bigger and better and um, reaching out to chefs in the community and, and bringing them back again next year. If you ever attended a festival you definitely know that parking is no joke. This year the North Monterey County cheer team took on this incredibly tough task of managing all of the traffic so when you came to the festival and you felt that smooth, and we heard nothing but great, great, great uh, reviews on our parking this year. Again, that was all managed this year with, from North Monterey County Cheer Team. On their very first year of being part of the festival, they knocked it out of the park, and we're incredibly grateful uh, for their uh, volunteering and for their team to be a part of, the, of this year's Artichoke Festival with us. So we have with us today, Alyssa Lowenson and Amber Jones, uh, the cheer varsity captain. Ladies, come on in. Thank you so much for being a part of this year's festival. And we have a little gift here, a little check to present to you. It will be a check for $3,000. How do you feel about that? Here it is. <laughs> here is a check for $3,000 $3, for your 
I don't know if everybody can see your face over there, <laughs> Amber, but uh, uh, for your participation and for being a part of the festival and definitely making parking awesome. We appreciate it so much. Thank you, thank you. Yeah. Um, so I've been the coach for about five years now and it's always been difficult to get donations and having my girls go out and help with the parking and make it as smooth as possible is great and this $3,000 is going to be great. It's going to help us do our youth camp for the youth in our community and teach them cheers and dances to perform with us at one of our games and it'll get a little gift for the girls as well. So we greatly appreciate it. Thank you. Um, I've been doing cheer this is for at North County. This is my third year, and I've we've never been able to volunteer to get a donation before, and this is really fun for me. So, thank you. If you're a festival goer, we probably all have something in common. We're looking to enjoy the sun and probably enjoy a nice ice cold beverage. That's where the North Monterey County Wrestling Team comes in. They provide all of the drinks and beverages, along with moving ice from vendor to vendor, up and down and across the festival grounds. This year, led by Matt Gallegos, one of our board members and wrestling coach, uh, along with Tony Perez, the assistant coach, and Ruben Cornejo, the uh, uh, team captain for the wrestling team, uh, is here to uh, be the recipients of our, our gift. Guys, why don't you come in and, and join me here on camera? Doing? I'm doing awesome. Tony, welcome. And, uh, and we um, are really honored uh, to have the wrestling team being a part of the Artichoke Festival. Really, the, um, you know, as you guys have seen and experienced, the drinks are no joke, right? You know, everybody is thirsty out there in the sun, whether they want an ice cold beverage, you know, or definitely a, a soft drink. Uh, but anyways, you guys do a phenomenal job of running that ice up and down. We hear you on the on the on the speaker, you know, and uh, we know it's definitely no easy task. So the Artichoke Festival really appreciates now for you guys the second year uh, of being a part of the festival. And we hope to have you guys for for years to come, you know, so. So with that, you know, we want to present this uh, this gift for three thousand wow. dollars to the North uh, County hi uh, High School Wrestling Team. So we want to say thank you to the uh, Ari Choke Festival Committee for this uh, donation because we took a tough hit last year with COVID, not having any uh, sports. So this is a really uh, great help to our team. Really appreciate that, guys. Thank you. I also like to th say a couple of things. I I'd like to. Thank the Artichoke Festival for the opportunity. This will greatly fund us in our endeavors and um, push us to greater excellence. We welcome all and every nonprofit organization and volunteers to help us in the following years. We have several events that we do put on as fundraisers, the Artichoke Festival being one of them, our haunted house, our golf tournament, and hopefully other events in the future. So please join us in supporting the Artichoke Festival and our nonprofit by joining us to make this next year another successful year. Thank you.